Working out is a way of life for Paul Yakaitis. He says that helps to make it easier as he gets ready to compete in the Detroit Senior Olympics. Paul kept me busy with a mix of cardio and strength training. We even went outside where he helped me perfect my softball pitch. He took it easy on me though and didn't take me through his entire routine. Carol Rogers has been working hard for a while now and hopes to add more medals to her collection. She has a word for her fellow seniors. I think it's very important for seniors to stay active, to keep their body moving. If your body gets stiff, it begins to catch up with you. But I think if you continue on moving, guess what? Your body will continue on moving, and sports is my favorite, so I move it like that. To those who think the Detroit Senior Olympics may be too much for them, Paul shared his humble side with me. In the back of my mind, I'm thinking, what do I have to do? Okay to improve. And consistency is key. Paul learns about some changes to this year's Olympics. Preparing for these Olympics is more than just physical. We met back up with Carol Rogers after playing and placing in her first event of the day. It's not important whether or not I win or lose. It's important whether or not I have fun. So I'm here just to have fun. She's got her own personal cheer squad who came to support her from near and far. Carol has a master plan to make it through all six of her events. Vendors were on hand to offer support and services to the seniors. After a bit of trash talk, Paul had to eat a small slice of humble pie after the 50 meter run. He still placed and had a great time while doing it. Fun is in, uh, in, winning. in winning. There's a lot happening at Adams Butzel Center, but it seems that the Parks and Recs Department has it all under control. Thoris was energetic and had many pearls of wisdom for her fellow seniors. As seniors, uh, I look at health issues with us as seniors that it gives us a time to uh, be athletic or to walk, run, swim, do whatever we want to do because it's all a part of keeping healthy. So many seniors were thrilled about being able to participate and look forward to the Detroit Senior Olympics each year. Everyone should come out and participate. This is an annual event for the Detroit Senior Olympics, ages 50 and up. Again, Sheila Grant for the City of Detroit.